free NAN scraper agent today. I'm going to show you how to scrape anything for free with NAN and get unlimited leads without coding. You're going to see exactly how I scraped 50 dentists in seconds and sent them straight to Google Sheets. I'll give you the full template for free so you don't need to set anything up yourself. Plus, I'll show you how to turn these leads into personalized AI emails that actually get responses. Hey, if we haven't met already, I'm the digital avatar of Julian Goldie, CEO of SEO agency Goldie Agency. Whilst he's helping clients get more leads and customers, I'm here to help you get the latest AI updates. So what I'm about to show you is going to blow your mind. This is a complete game changer for anyone who needs leads. And I mean anyone, whether you're running an agency, doing affiliate marketing, or just trying to build your business, you can scrape leads from Google Maps, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, pretty much anywhere on the internet. And here's the crazy part. You can do it all for free, no coding required, and then you can use AI to write personalized emails that actually convert. Let me show you exactly what I mean. Look at this example. We scraped 50 dentists and got all their details, phone numbers, email addresses, locations, everything. And this took literally seconds to do, not hours, not days, seconds. Then we blasted all that data straight into a Google Sheet, completely automated. You don't even need to map the fields yourself. NAN does it all for you. But here's where it gets really interesting. Once you have all this data, you can plug it into AI and create personalized outreach emails for each lead. So instead of sending the same boring template to everyone, you're sending custom messages that mention their business name, their location, their specific industry. And trust me, this works. When someone gets an email that's clearly written just for them, they actually read it, they actually respond. Now you might be thinking, okay, Julian, this sounds expensive. How much is this gonna cost me? Here's the beautiful part. You get $5 usage every month with Appify. Let me show you exactly how this works step by step and stick around because I'm gonna give you the complete template at the end so you can set this up in minutes, not hours. So the magic happens with something called Appify. Inside their app store, they have these things called actors. Think of actors as pre-built agents for web scraping. They've already done all the hard work for you. You can scrape Google Maps for local businesses. You can scrape Instagram for viral posts. You can scrape Facebook groups for comments, LinkedIn profiles for prospects. Twitter for trending content. The list goes on and on. There's literally thousands of these scrapers already built and ready to use. And the best part is you just plug them into NAN and boom, you have a complete automation. Let me walk you through this from scratch so you can see exactly how easy it is. First, we start with an HTTP request in NAN. We set this to post. Then we go to Appify and pick which scraper we wanna use. For this example, let's use the Google Maps scraper. Inside the Google Maps scraper, you tell it what to search for. Let's say we want to search Chinese restaurants in New York. You can choose how many results you want. You can choose whether you want to extract 50 different responses or 30 or whatever you need. Obviously, the more responses you use, the more API credits you're going to use in your free usage section. But the point here is that you can scrape almost anything you want using these free agents. Then you copy the API endpoint from Appify and paste it into your NAN workflow. You also copy the JSON configuration that tells the scraper exactly what to look for. Hit test and boom. Your scraper is now running, it's going through Google Maps, finding every Chinese restaurant in New York and grabbing all their details. But we're not done yet, we need to get the results. So we add another HTTP request, but this time we set it to get. We use a different endpoint called get last data set items that grabs the scraped data. And just like that, we have all the restaurant data flowing through our NAN workflow, names, addresses, phone numbers, websites, reviews, everything. Now here's where it gets really powerful. We can take all this data and send it straight to a Google Sheet. NAN has a built-in Google Sheets integration. You just tell it which sheet to use and you get an option to map each column manually or map automatically. I always choose map automatically just to save time. Basically, you get all the headings inside the spreadsheet mapped to the Google Maps scraping search. So now you have a Google Sheet that's automatically filled with fresh leads every time you run your scraper. No copy pasting, no manual work. It's all automated. Now, if you want to learn more advanced AI automation techniques like this, you should check out my AI Success Lab. I've got over 14,000 members in there learning how to use AI to grow their businesses. Inside the lab, you get access to over 100 different AI tutorials, templates, and use cases. I show you exactly how to set up automations like this one, plus way more advanced stuff. And the best part is it's completely free. Link is in the comments and description. Let me show you another example. Let's say you want to scrape for SEO agencies. Same process. We go back to the Google Maps scraper. We change the search to SEO agencies. We want to scrape in New York, 50 places to extract. We grab the endpoint. We get the run actor section. Copy that. Go back to NAN. Insert that into the first HTTP request. Post URL, send JSON using JSON. And obviously, if you change any of the filters, then the JSON changes as well. Hit test step, make sure it works. And then you can see all your previous runs. You can see what you're doing, how it worked. 
how much it cost. What I would typically do if you wanted to run this from scratch is add a wait section, wait about 22 seconds before you go ahead. That will just allow the website scraper to scrape and complete scraping before you move on to the next step. Then we test that step and boom, look at that. We've got all the internet marketing services and SEO agencies in the local area of New York using that process. Really simple and easy. Now, if you wanna clean this up and keep it all neat and tidy, you can use the tidying up button. Then if you wanna add a new module, let's say you wanna send this to Google Sheets, we can add a Google Sheets section, click on append row and sheet. Inside this section, we update that sheet and you get an option to map each column manually or map automatically. I'm going to map automatically just to save time. Basically, we've got all the headings inside the spreadsheet mapped to the Google Map scraping search. If we click on test step now, that's gonna send all this information to the Google Sheet. You can see it's all been appended to the spreadsheet. So we've got all these SEO agencies inside New York from Google Maps listings, and we're living the dreams. Now, let's say you wanted to take this information and do some outreach. There's a couple of ways you could do that. You could take the information from the spreadsheet. You could go over to ChatGPT. You could say something like, create a short, funny, personalized email to this person from my SEO agency to sell white label link building to them. And you can see it creates an interesting outreach email template based on the personalized details of that lead. For example, it might say something about Millionify, and Millionify is the name of the agency, even more Millionify with easy link building. So it says something like, how many tabs you have open right now? If the answer is too many, you don't need another thing on your plate. Here's how we can help you. Millionify plus our links equals your client's ranking, your margins laughing, and you're finally having time for lunch. So that's one way to do it. The other way you can do it is you could take the information and get an AI agent. Then we can define this information. We can take all the information from the Google Sheet, the title, the address, the website, then we can add a chat GPT agent, open AI chat model, we'll select GPT. We can take the information from Google Sheets and send that to the AI agent. We can tell the AI agent with a system message. You are an outreach assistant helping me write emails for my leads based on the information in the prompt. And we've put in the address, the website, the title, we could put the neighborhood as well. And this is basically taking the information from the Google Sheet about the lead and then using that to automate the outreach. For example, we can say lead details here. Based on the information in the prompt, write a nice personalized email. Then we can add a chat trigger and you can see it's taking the information from the Google sheet in the email based on this. Pretty simple and easy, but let's try another example now. Let's say we wanna build something with Twitter. We can put in an HTTP request. In fact, let's try Twitter just to mix it up. Let's say we're targeting content around AI agents. We want the latest content, maybe the top 10 tweets. We can do that. We'll grab the API key, grab the endpoint, copy that, go back, post URL. Inside the send body, we'll select using JSON, then we'll grab the JSON, copy this, go back, plug this in, hit test step. That's running now. Then we can add a new HTTP request. We're gonna link that in, we'll select it on get. Then we're gonna take the URL from the API. Let's grab that, we'll get the endpoint. We'll scroll down, we'll get the last run, data set items, copy that. Then we're gonna go back to NAN, paste in the URL. You don't need to do anything else. And you can see the node is executed perfectly. And we're good to go on that. So it's really easy to set this up. Once you get the hang of it, once you get your head around it, it's super simple stuff. The cool thing about NAN particularly is that you can self-host this and then it's free as well. So at that point, you're not paying for NAN. You're not paying for anything. All of this is pretty much free. Now, I want to address something important. You might be wondering if this is ethical or legal. The answer is yes, as long as you're scraping publicly available information and you're using it responsibly. Google Maps listings are public. Social media posts are public. Company websites are public. You're not hacking into private databases or stealing confidential information. Now, if you're serious about scaling your business with AI, you need to check out my AI Profit Boardroom. It's the best place to scale your business, get more customers, and save hundreds of hours with AI automation. We currently have over 1,000 members who are all learning how to use AI to grow their businesses faster. Inside the boardroom, you get access to my most advanced automation workflows and templates. You get weekly coaching calls where I answer your questions directly. You get a community of like-minded entrepreneurs who are all on the same journey Link is in the comments and description. You can also book a free SEO strategy session with my team. We'll look at your current situation and show you exactly how to get more leads and customers using SEO and AI automation. No pitch, no pressure, just pure value. Link is also in the comments and description. And remember, you can get the complete N8N scraper template for free inside my AI success lab. Plus you'll get access to over a hundred other AI tutorials and use cases. With 14,000 members, you'll be joining a massive community of people who are all learning how to use AI to grow their businesses. You see how I show a checklist of 100 different tutorials that are given away as freebies every day inside the community. You can get all the video notes from there and all the other stuff that you get along with all the trainings in the AI Success Lab. Link is in the comments and description. Julian Goldie reads every comment, so make sure you comment below. 
and let me know what you're going to scrape first. I'd love to hear about your results. And if you found this video helpful, smash that like button and subscribe for more AI automation tutorials. I'm dropping new content every week that shows you exactly how to use AI to grow your business faster. Until next time, keep automating and keep growing.